What's up guys, this is Shane with Dark Horse Rowing and we are back this week with another rowing in inappropriate places. And guess where we are this week? Mexico. This is our series where we take the Concept 2 rower all over the world to all the most interesting places possible in an effort to show you guys what's possible that you can be fit all you gotta do is get outside and start. This is awesome, we're right on the coast, so I'm gonna get a workout in on the coast, but that means we're not gonna do any major hill climbs or distance runs because of the location that I'm at. Instead, we're gonna do some repeats. Let's see how it feels. Oh. All right, well, one-handed, much more comfortable. So the workout is going to be running up and down the coastline for 30 minutes. Every time I get to the top of the hill, I'm gonna do a 500 meter row plus 10 push-ups. Let us know how you do in the comments below. I feel like the biggest challenge I have with this machine, I'm always catching bushes and trees. We'll find a way around that at some point. Round two. Nice slow grind. That's working pretty well. Ten minutes in. Twenty minutes left. Good work, babe. How far in are we? That's right. This is the end of round three. How's your shoulder feeling? Shoulder's good. Way more comfortable. The pads are working out. Round four. She usually races up and down the hill, so I don't know why she's. Time. That was five rounds. So, that was a 30 minute AMRAP, a 400 meter run. 200 down, 200 up, carrying the machine, 500 meter row, and 10 push ups. That was a fun one. Not, not too bad. And just nice to get out to this. So guys, this has been another episode of Rowing Inappropriately, because why not? Leave in the comments below where you take your machine and where you'd like to see us take our machine. Make sure you subscribe and share our videos to catch the next crazy place that we're gonna go to row inappropriately. We will see you on the other side. It's me filming here. Oh, I don't know how this works. Anyway, just thought you want to do like a behind the scenes, how I am the foundation of this entire company and how my subpar video skills are basically keeping this family afloat. <laughs> like I can't work with this.